Unique wooden masks are carved to honor the dead. Placed in sacred shrines, these masks gradually return to dust, symbolizing the spirit's peaceful journey into the next life. Not all spirits can travel this path alone. Struggling with tragedies of their past, they linger and become dangerous. Master is called upon to help those trapped, and violent manifestations are known as spirit guides. Oh, those must be the masks of the dead. What a cool power to have! I guess that sends out a flare that seems to respond to some of the things we have here. And lights our way. Oh, what's that? <gasps> what is that? Was that a spirit? Am I supposed to be following these ones? So are these spirits of the dead, of the past? Oh, look at this. Oh, I wish I could read these. Oh, look, where are they all going? Are we coming here? Oh, wow. We are, look. Oh, did you see that mask? Oh my gosh, this is amazing. What a beautiful world. The way has been opened. But this place seems like it's been abandoned for a long time. But I guess if the lights only react to like a spirit master or spirit guide being here. Oh, okay. That person has red. We've got blue. I'm suspicious. And suffering here, spirit. Do you need help? You know nothing of suffering. This is my home, my village. Turn back, spirit guide. Oh, boy. Okay, that guy didn't fall apart as easily as I was hoping. All right, all right, gotta fight. Uh, and these guys are not exactly easy to fight either. They're pretty nimble on their feet or their bones, I suppose. All right, where'd he go? Where is everybody? If this is his village, was it destroyed? Are the spirits trying to return for vengeance somehow? Oh, wow. What happened here? Can I open this? All right, all right. Well, I was able to fight him, but now what? Oh, oh. <gasps> oh, wow. I guess we need to connect the spirit of this area, this land, back together again. And then... Yeah, there we go. Where will this take 
chicas. This is beautiful. Oh, this is so beautiful. But where are we? Look! Oh my gosh! This is a, this is actually a statue that's been completely destroyed, made out of mossy stone and glowing crystals and wood. It's beautiful. And there's relics and bits of temples over here. I wonder if that was a cave where once upon a time we left the masks of the dead so their spirits would be able to find a way forward. It doesn't seem like my power has a big effect here, but. Oh wait, no it does! It looks like I can interact with this spot and maybe see their prayers. So I can see maybe the past or what the spirits want to be doing in the afterlife. I have no idea. Oh, but this is beautiful. Interesting. Oh, wow! Look at that! Oh, that is so stunning! So there's definitely... Maybe that's a shrine to some sort of forest god. Look at all of the offerings of incense that are lined up against it. Oh! Oh! I saw something! Did you guys see? Down here! Oh, they're children, I think! Are those children? <gasps> Where did he go? Does that mean those were the spirits of the undead? And there's a rot wisp. A rot wisp, huh? And I can collect it, huh? I found a friend! I would think rot is something bad, but if I found this little guy to collect... <laughs> All right, he looks he looks too adorable. Hi. Hello. It's all right. What happened here, little guy? Hmm. <laughs> oh, I saw my own blood glowing with that. rot in the area, huh? So I guess he's my little friend, but they're rot spirits. And I think those children were two siblings. Oh, did I find it? Oh, hi! So I need to find more of them, huh? Alright, well, let's see. Is this gonna help me enough? Oh, there we go. Okay. So he actually can help me find, like, spots where maybe the spirits... Oh, that's really pretty. Oh, wow. This world is so gorgeous. Oh, I wish I could just spend forever wandering it. Oh, look at the foxes. Like, this is just so... It's ridiculously beautiful. Alright, so we're looking for more rot spirits. 
Are these little ones or else? Oh, we found another one! It seems the children are following the- Oh, cute! So I'm looking for five of these guys. I mean, on the one hand, like, I think rot is a bad thing. But on the other hand, they're so cute! And why are the kids hiding from me? Oh, look at the mushrooms growing on the trees. And a whole bunch of mushrooms popped up now that we found him. I hope those kids, if they are the spirits of the dead, I hope we'll be able to take care of those kids somehow. At least they have each other too. What about over here? Let's see. Nothing there. Oh, oh wow. Wow! Okay, up, up, I want up, not down, I want up. <laughs> Dang it. All right, I'll have to work on that. Oh, it's so pretty. There we go. So I wonder if another one of their little rot friends would be attracted. There we go to this spot then, behind a waterfall. Maybe? Oh yeah, look! We found another one! <laughs> and he was hiding behind the waterfall! That's adorable! Look, and all of the little mushrooms popped up and now he's following us too. Oh, this is so beautiful. All right, well, now that we found these three, let's see if we can find the other two. There we go. And those two. Okay, this looks like trouble. This is more what I thought rot would look like and what it would be. Collect more rot to purify the dead heart zone. So if we find these rot spirits, I might be able to purify this, huh? That sounds like a good idea. All right, well, let's come back and keep looking then. That's that's really quite terrifying that... Oh, there they go. They're trying to hide from us, but I hope we can convince them to come out. Another one! And the mushrooms pop up and the rot are dancing around. See anything down here? No. Look at how huge all of these ancient ruins are. So whatever civilization was here definitely built something so stunningly beautiful. I just wish I could spend forever wandering all of these gorgeous ruins. They're so stunning. Alright, let's jump through here. So I need to find another spot where some rot spirits might be hiding. So maybe up here? Oh look! <laughs> hiding inside of that little lantern. There we go! So now we have several of our little friends, so I can interact with them, huh? Oh my gosh! You can just sit and play with them! Are you kidding? This is adorable! And we've leveled up because we have so many. The rot can now perform more actions. The rot can help. Your team of companions has grown and you now have one rot action available. So we can go send the rots into actions in the environment, collect rot to level up and gain more rot actions. Got it. Oh, look at them! Oh, you can kiss and snuggle with them! That is so precious! And they just dance! Oh my gosh, that's way too cute! There we go! Alright, guys! Well, we've leveled up! That's so cute! Oh my gosh, and you can, like, actually go ahead. Oh, that's so cool! You can just kind of stop everything where it's at and take pictures! People know what I want! I want pictures! Wait, stop moving! 
there we go. Yeah, that's, sorry, that's the drift that's innate inside of my very old controller. But let's go ahead and take a photo of this because this is just stunningly beautiful. <laughs> Which apparently gave us even more, um, even more abilities and then actions. Oh, this is so cool. I love this. I really love this. Okay, that's really cute. You can actually have her go ahead and say cheese. Okay, that's that's adorable. I didn't expect to stumble on that. But let's see what our little friends can do. I guess I'm a spirit guide. I guess technically these little ones might be spirits. But if we need their help... <gasps> oh, wow. All right. Now that is quite satisfying. All right, you guys. Well, let's keep exploring a little bit more. Now we have turned what was a horrifying rotted tree into a beautiful mossy covered tree trunk. I think that just goes to show we're not bad. We're definitely trying to help out. I was just fighting the undead a second ago too, which I think gives me a little bit of credit. All right, let's see. Here we go. No! Oh, darn it. Well, at least we made it through. All right, here we go. And we'll get a running leap. There we are. Oh, I see. There we go. Now I just need to keep going. Oh, oh, I see. Okay, so that's actually for like all pictures. Made it up these ledges. Fascinating. Okay, and so we've already gone up one level with our rot, being able to destroy the last dead heart zone. But I guess our job is to destroy all these other dead heart zones as well. I wonder where everybody else is. I haven't seen any other like life. Are we the only ones left? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Enemies frighten the rot. The rot are scared and have gone to hiding. Attack enemies to build courage. In combat, spend courage to perform rot actions. Courage drops can form in the world. Collect courage drops with your pulse or touch them to gain courage faster. Okay, so I need to have courage. Okay, rot action available. Oh, they, they're seeing us be very brave. So we need to destroy dead zone hearts or bind enemies. All right. Okay, I'll do my best. In you go, guys. Okay, gotta fight. Okay, there's a bit of courage. Oh, oh, that's definitely gonna hurt if I don't hurry. All right, let's get a little bit more courage. And is there another heart I can target them at? Oh, these dead heart, like, hearts are really dangerous, I think. Oh, and then I need to pulse. Oh, wow. And then together, that's what we do. Oh, that's amazing. That's really beautiful and amazing. I'm so proud of our little rot friends. That's so interesting that we would call them rot. But then the dead hearts are what we really need to fear and watch out for. Well, there's the children again. I hope they made it through that dead heart area okay. Oh, and what's going on over here now? See that over there? Oh, the rot can move certain objects in their environment. Oh, they can help us pick it up and move it about. Oh, that's adorable. But how do I tell them? Oh, over here maybe. So maybe I need them to put it, let's see, aim right here. Can you guys bring it here? Oh dear, I think they dropped it. <laughs> well, we'll figure this out. We will figure this out. It seems like we have quite the helpful little crew trying to go ahead and guide us. All right, I see. And then we can tell them where to move it. So I just need to figure out where that needs to go. Let's try right over here. 
then, aha, uh -huh, that might let me actually reach up to the ledge. Look at that, how helpful they are. All right, we'll see how this goes. We'll have them release it. And I can actually, wait, 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 I can actually dance with them just like right here. Hang on one second. All right, let's go over here. I'm trying to figure out the right way. I want to sit with them for a second and dance. They're my little friends after all. Hi, little guys. Oh, there he goes. Now he's dancing. Oh, that's precious. All right, guys. Well, welcome. Welcome to Kenna, Bridge of Spirits, where we are exploring this world that is completely new to me. I know literally nothing about what we're doing except what we stumble on as we go through. If you guys would like to join us on this adventure, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, stay curious, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.